Hi, this is Lakshmi. Today I am going to explain you about how to create a first uh, report using SSRS. Here what I am going to do is first of all in the Visual Studio we have to download our SSRS data tool. For that what we have to do is in our uh, Visual Studio here in the extensions tab manage extensions here what we are going to do is we have to download this Microsoft Reporting Services project. After downloading this what we have to do is we have to go for a new project then here we can use like by, by searching these templates we can use see by searching all these templates this is what we will be getting after downloading that one so report server project wizard and report server project first this is as this is a simple uh, uh, creating the report here I am going to use a report server project and then I am going to create next so here what I am going to do is I am going to re, uh, name as a project name as a report underscore student so I am going to get this student details like a report of this particular student one so I am going to create this one so this project is created after the solution is created here we can see for this report student report here we are going to see this shared data sources shared data sets and reports here what is this a shared data sources is nothing but here we will be finding all the shared data sources that is where we are going to get that particular data for this uh, report student and this uh, shared data sets is nothing but those are the sets which are used by those shared data sources and the reports is where we are having the different kinds of reports here so first what we are going to do is we are going to create a new data source so here what is our data source here my data source is Microsoft SQL server here we have to make a connection string so I am going to build the, that connection so my Microsoft SQL server this is there so what I am going to do is I am going to get this connection path so this server name I am, I am copying this server name and I am pasting over here so after as mine is an SQL server authentication I am giving my authentication user ID and password and I am going to connect to that database which which I want to connect it so student warehouse database so I am checking the test connection succeeded so next hit ok next the build is over then it ok so now the shared data source that is my data source that is database is connected over here and then I want to create a report I am clicking on the new add new report then my data source is the name of the data source one so next I am going to the next so here it's asking about uh, my user ID and password for my data source so okay now I am going to click on the query builder here I am going to create that query or we can add it as a text or also we can do or here I am going to do select star from student details I have a data in student details table in my in my thing so next okay so the student ID student name student range all the data has been got so next thing is select said this one how do we want to this uh, report type what kind of ta report type should be look like tabular one or matrix one in the as this is the first uh, first SSRS one report I am going to use a tabular form only so next hit next so these are the details which we want all the columns I am I am selecting all student ID student name and student branch all those things and then next so this report name what is the report name then click preview report finish so now this report will be formed and the preview can be seen here what I am going to see is it's connecting my database and again it's going to ask this see all the data like student ID student name and print the data which is present here see if you want I'll show you here database student warehouse select star from student details 
so the data here well, which is there that data we got it as a report over here in this uh, preview we have seen this report like student id student name and student and in the design you can have this student id all these things so after this one if you want to add or insert see if you right click over this column we can insert a column left or right wherever we want and the here also in the rows if you want to create a insert a row we can insert a row see in this below or above like what are, what are the options like we have we can have this all the options here to edit all those things so this is how in which format or which report format we want this the data can be we can create we can create that kind of reports here so this as this is our first ssrs one so this is a simple report that i have created here so if you like my video please subscribe my video and share my video thank you thank you for listening